Hey YouTube, Frog Toad here. Well, we're out here at the outdoor range up at Frog Dad's house, and uh, we're gonna give a new ammo a try. This is uh, USA Ammo, and I got this from a deal through Gearhog, um, one of those kind of places you keep an eye on, they come up with deals, and um, the deal was great. I, did, I, I was really happy with the price, and I ended up getting 500 rounds of 380. So what we're going to do up here today is run some of it through the LCP. See how good it is. And uh, accuracy, um, it's a mouse gun. So we're just going to see if it's as accurate as I've been with other ammunitions. So we'll load a little bit of it up here and give it a whirl. Now from what I understand they get their brass from shooting ranges and places like that and they reload it. So I guess you know I guess you can't call it factory. Factory from USA ammo. I guess depends how you look at that. You know I'm not uh, I'm not picky. You know if it's good bullets and it goes where I point and it goes bang when I pull the trigger I consider it good. So uh we're gonna go give it a try. Well, I wasn't able to get as much video of the actual shooting as I wanted to. I had a little problem with camera and batteries. But we ended up putting a hundred plus this short of another 50 uh, through the LCP and it all fired fine. I had one failure to feed which just could have been me getting tired. I had been shooting pretty much all of two days uh, before this happened and I, mean, I could have limp wristed it. That's, that's real possible so um, I'll give it a pass. So for the price um, Man, I'll try and remember to annotate the price. I, I want to say that after all was said and done with the discounts and everything, I paid somewhere in the 50 or $60 range for 500 rounds. And if out of 100 and what am I here? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11, 50, what, 39, say 40. So say out of 140 rounds, I had one failure to feed. I, I can't complain too much about that, and I, I could not get it to do it again, so I didn't have that problem. So, I give it the recommendation. For that money, I, I will be buying this ammo again, no doubt about it. Even without the discount uh, that I got through Gearhog, the per bullet price is definitely right up there with what you see from Cheaper Than Dirt and some of the other places. So, I give it a thumbs up. Uh, now I have to go and clean this poor thing and uh, one thing about my little Keltec modification here is that has come loose so I guess I'm gonna have to Loctite that but there you go USA ammo I like it um, I recommend it for what it's worth so fair winds y'all we'll see you next time